Hello and welcome back to my YouTube. We are playing Jurassic World Evolution and my name is Cezis. I'm really excited to be continuing today. I have a little bit of a plan of what we are going to get up to. Look at the little monorail just gliding on by. We are on, on the first island and I am going to be sending out as many expeditions as I can. Uh, probably will be editing out those because it's very repetitive. But we have quite a few of different DNAs or genomes that we don't have yet. And some that are not at 100% yet. So for here, for instance, we have the Ankylosaurus that we need and the Corotosaurus. I'm going to be butchering these. We also have the Nasuceratops that we need more uh, DNA from or genomes. And then we have all the way over here in Asia, quite a few that we don't have yet. We have the Diplosaurus that we need to get, I think it was like 60% DNA to complete a mission for, but we're going to get it to 100 of course as well. And then we have the Shongkingsaurus and the Hygienagosaurus. Oh my god, why are these so hard to pronounce? And we have the Critonosaurus over here, as well as the Vel Velociraptor. A meat eater and uh, so i will be sending those out as well as distracting extracting all the dna's from uh, whatever we are picking up and of course the dna's that like this one that we can just sell i'm going to be using on our second island for boosting the money over there but while i am doing that behind the curtains so to speak we are going to be building a little bit over in this area tonight. So if we look at the map, I have a little bit of space over here. And what I'm thinking is that since we are getting another carnivore at some point, the, the Diplo and the Veloraptor thingy. And I don't think I want to put those in here. I, like, I am not sure, but my thought is at least that I don't want them together with these two dudes over here saruman and grima so i kind of want to make a little e enclosure here and probably then make this one that we made the big one here make this a bit smaller uh to fit in another enclosure and a hotel and maybe some guest facilities as well so that's what we're going to be doing tonight while i also do the expedition stuff so I have no idea how I'm going to be editing that together with like going to do the expeditions are kind of like intrusive since you have to keep on top of it to uh, get all of the stuff. But we're never going to advance our islands if we don't get, you know, a good variety of dinos. So we can't forget to do that. So I think we will start with... Yeah, with making this enclosure smaller. I don't know what kind of fence it is that we're using here. Is it this kind of fence? Yes, I think so. Light steel fence. We also have the electric fence and the heavy steel fence. So I think I'm just going to use the heavy steel fence. My thought is that we'll do a walkway, there's some old railings here, a walkway that leads to a hotel, some guest facilities, and somehow also squeeze in a little compound and a little Hammond creation lab. Well, this one is not that little, but you know, try and get it um, in together. But I'm also thinking that do you really need a creation lab? Because we could technically create all the carnivores in this enclosure and then just airlift them out of there into another enclosure. That's a little bit more work, but that would be saving some space. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, we are going to be building this area tonight.
okay, I, I don't know if I'm qualified to make ground even in this game. All right, so we have a hotel. Next up, we're going to be doing the um, electricity for it. And of course, also making the other guest facilities. Oh no, someone is dead. Wait, what? Ooh. Oh no. Frodo! No! Oh no, oh no! Oh! Look at Bilbo! Oh, I'm so sorry! Oh! Wow, he, he really looks kind of terrifying like that. Alright, um, how do we transport Frodo out of there? Was that the ACU team? I think so. Ah, okay, let's see if we can do the pilot helicopter. <laughs> we did this last time, so, you know, maybe, maybe we can do this. Let's... Oh god. Um, how do I go upwards? Maybe this is not the right unit, because I can only trank dinos with this. Yeah. I don't see the option for picking the dead dino up. So this is probably not the correct. Oh god, I, I'm trying to get back to the platform. <laughs> came from here? This land. Oh, that's actually pretty good, I think. Nice. Um, which one is it then that does it? I thought it was this team. Maybe it's that you can't do it. You can't transport dead dinos by yourself. Yeah, it looks like it. You have to do it like this. Bye bye, Frodo. Oh yeah, because it's a completely different helicopter. It's not this one. It's this yellow one that comes in to to get the dino. Bye, Frodo. I'll miss you. And with that sad goodbye, we'll go back and uh, build on our new area. Which Asset first we need the power.
not a dead dino. Oh no, who died now? Hmm. Oh. Oh, where? Oh, there. Who is that? Oh. Oh, it's one that isn't named. That's still sad, though. Look at them. They died of old age. I guess that's good. We haven't yet lost a dino to anything else than, than old age. So I, I think that that's a good thing. We've been taking well care of them. Bye-bye. Little dino. They're coming to pick him up. Oh. I wish they lived longer. I feel like they live kind of short. But... Oh, look at Bilbo running around. So cute. And Sam is just chilling over there. Adorable little babies. So, back to building the enclosure. We were using the electrical fans. And I was... <laughs> I was kind of hoping to... Get it to be... Pretty close to the hotel here, but... I'm realizing that we put the hotel so close that I can't really... Don't, can't really bring it to this side and then go back again. That's, that's not gonna work out, so... I should have thought this through a, a little better, maybe. Then we're definitely going to need to fit in a, um, a viewing gallery of sorts as well. Which viewing gallery takes up the least amount of space? I guess it would be this one because it's kind of tiny. But it's not as good as this one. Oh, maybe we should have made a path. I should have made a path go way closer to this over here. So that we could actually fit this in. Alright, let's let's fix that. That's so pretty! Oh, does this fit over here? Of course it doesn't. <laughs> Stupid game. Um, like, it can't even be close to pots. That's really annoying. Which tree would be nicest? I think these ones. Let's put it there. Oh no! Not another dead dino again. What? There's gonna be a lot of dead dinos now or something. Look, it should be able to fit there. Game, come on. Don't do this to me. This tree here. And a tree there. And one here. Look, that looks nice, right? I like that. Oh, what little baby? Died this time. Oh no, it's Legolas! No, what? Our Dracorex. What? This one, this one isn't that old. It died of old age. Oh no. Oh no, and this one is the one that is like, it gets really depressed. If it's, if it's left alone and don't have a, a friend of the same species. 
Yeah, I think Arwen is going to get lonely now. Oh no, we have to make a Legolas 2.0 really quickly here. Incubate. And where are you? There you are. Uh, do we modify the genome? All right, let's do this one for the uh, lifespan. Incubate. All right, so we're making a friend for Arwen or Legolas 2.2 is what two point oh is what we're making, and then we can go back to try and figure out this compound here and uh, electrical fence. And where does it snap? It snaps over here, already. Right? Alright, so we can't bring this very close either. But something like that. Like this. That doesn't look too bad. We're making a nice profit on this island, so that's good. And then it attaches here. And uh make it go. Oh no, a disease! Oh, damn. Um, let's bring this very close to the toilets here because I want the hotel to be able to also have a viewing over these dinos. So that's why I'm bringing this all the way over there. So this hotel will like have a little bit of a view over it. Where do we have some disease? No, over here. Rosie has a common cold. You know what that means? It's time for Sus's driving again. <laughs> okay. Ranger team. Drive vehicle. Here we go. Toot toot. Oh, 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 oh. E Watch out! Coming through! Oh god, why have I... Why have I planted these trees right here? <laughs> what in the... What? When did I do that? I don't even remember. Okay, so how do we do this? Is it the dart rifle? I think so. And then... Asset in range. We zoom in and... Oh my god. Nope, that did not work. Uh, we have to get closer. Boom! Okay, Rosie, can you like please stand still for me a little bit so I can do this? Thank you. Oh god, she's so far away still. Yes, okay, that medication. No oh, diseased nice. dinosaurs detected. Oh, we did it. Good. And while we are here, we might as well, I guess, refill these um, eaters. Which we do by pressing R, right? No, like that. The mouse. Refilled. And then we'll refill this one over here too. Feeder oh. supplies back oh. to normal. Uh, mm. Let's turn around and leave before we piss off the dinos and they start attacking us. Oh, like, like so, he's... Yep, okay, there we go. <laughs> Alright, you have to find your way Switching back roles. by yourself. It's time to release uh, Legolas 2.0 here. At least I know. Come out, little one. Oh, look at Arwen is right there to greet her new friend. Oh, I like this yellow tint. It looks very colorful. Very cute. It looks almost like gold or amber. Welcome, welcome, little one! You are definitely one of my favorites. Definitely one of my favorite uh, dinos in the game so far. Just look at his little face! Hello! We're gonna name you Lea Gulas 2.0. And he's the alpha now. Because your star rating. Oh, your star rating is 2. 
That's nice. Good. Now Arwen shouldn't be so lonely anymore and her comfort is going up. And then we can continue our building over here. So we enclosed the um, compound. And I am really confused about this. I don't know how the electricity works. Because this whole thing was without electricity. And now all of a sudden it has electricity. And I think that it might be because it's now like somehow... Like this fence is getting electricity from the substation. And then with this fence having electricity that then brings electricity to the creation center but i i'm honestly i'm, I'm not sure one tonight oh no who is that rosie oh no died of old age rip oh i don't remember what pattern rosie was can we see that arid that's what made this yellow uh, tint of her skin. We're gonna have to airlift her out of there. Bye As bye, Rosie. We will remember you. I feel kind of happy about how this turned out. I mean, it's by no means perfect or anything. It could definitely be way more beautiful. But it's... I think Transit it's the... It's the first area that we made that doesn't look like utter shit. <laughs> or like crap. Uh, oh god, I keep pressing the wrong buttons when I want scenery stuff. I want like... I guess this kind of tree. Yes. There. Oh, that looks good. Then maybe we can place some of these... If they fit over here? Nope, they do not. But they do here. So let's get a few... ...in around the monorail. Uh, was it this one that we were doing or this one? Oh, what's the other one? Let's see. There. And here. Look at that! That doesn't look half bad, I think. Then maybe this really big tree? This one. Oh, it's so large. I don't, I don't even know. Like... It takes up such huge space. Like, it's enormous. It's too... It's too big, right? Maybe we can plant these little palm tree things. Oh, was it blue there for just a second? Oh, it was! Oh my god, where is it? There. Oh, that's so nice. Perfect. Can we get one here too? Nope. Oh, but that looks great. Okay, very happy with that. Oh no, feeder needs resupplying. All right, we gotta have to do that. 
We need the ACU team to be able to resupply the feeders and the feeder that needs to resupply is in here and is there anywhere else? It seems to be two. Oh yeah, both of them over there. All right. So ACU... No, Ranger team. Sorry, wrong thing. Here we go. Ranger team and... Dry vehicle. Yes, look at that. We have now completed the genome for the cryo tires. Dry vehicle. I'm really doing my best to... While I'm building... Building the area uh, that I'm also going and uh, sending the expedition. Where is the door? Is the door over here? Yes, this is where the door is. And the feeders are over here. Yes. Okay. Let's try not to get hit by the dinos. <laughs> Let's go. The triceptors are the ones that I feel. Ooh. <gasps> Okay, I have not gotten any better at driving, apparently. At all. I flipped the entire freaking car. <laughs> okay, resupply this one. Good. Let's get out before the triceptors get angry. Whom? I think this was a pretty good place for the door, though. It's kind of in the middle between the boats. Both the feeders. Vroom, vroom. All right, you can find your way back yourself, little car. What if I place it? What, how would it look like if I do it like this? Oh no, not another dead dino. <laughs> what is happening? Why, why are they all dying? No. No, 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 no. Who is dead this time? Sam! Oh, he died in the water. And he also died of old age. I feel like all our babies, all our babies are dying. All the original first versions of the dinos that we got. Bye, Sam. That's the fourth one tonight. What in the world? Oh no, another dinosaur died again? What? How is this possible? Why? Why? Oh no. Ah, oh, this isn't working either. Um. Who is it that is dead this time? Oh, this is such a depressing episode. Wait, there's no one in this one? 
Oh. Oh. Well. Grimma. Wait, isn't Grimma younger than Saruman? I thought Saruman were the first carnivore we got. Oh. Hello. I don't like you, but I'm still kind of sad that you died. I'm sorry. At least you died of old age. Rip Grimma. That is the fifth dino tonight! I feel like this this episode is cursed. Heading to collect the asset. No. Alright, let's see if we can actually get this um uh pots over here to look nice. anymore we have two dead dinos now no arween and bilbo i'm seriously gonna start crying <laughs> I'm so sad now. All right, we're gonna have to transport them both out of here. Bye, Head Bilbo. Bye, Arwen. And um, with how um sad our Legolas 2.0 is gonna get without a friend, we're gonna have to do that. Um, make sure that we make another another Arwen 2.0 incubate oh bye 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 Pilbo Asset has been collected. Bye, Arwing. Bye, bye, babies. We have no dinos left in the park now. I feel so sad. Oh. Oh. Well, on a good note, what we've been doing, um, at least, is working hard on getting new. DNAs dug up. I have um, completed a few dinos tonight in in DNA, which I will show you here. If we go to making one, so we have the Ankylosaurus at a hundred, and we have the Creotosaurus at a hundred, and also this one that we haven't made any of yet. So I'm really excited to to check how this one is gonna look moving around. And next I know that we're working on is the Diplosaurus. And um, we didn't make the bestest of... Uh, like, I was about to say that I didn't do so much progress over here. But actually, I feel, I feel good about it. We made a whole compound, a new hotel. And we started on a, another area even. And made some improvements on this one in terms of... 
view ability. Too bad that we don't have any dinos for people to look at, though. <laughs> we, we're going to have to, uh, to fix uh, that. But first, we are going to release Arwen 2.0 here. Welcome out. Come, come. Hi, honey. You are going to replace your predecessor. Hopefully, you will live longer than she did. And there we go. We also now unlocked being able to um, make Diplosauruses. That means I think we have the genome at 60%. We are pleased to welcome, welcome Arween 2.0. There we go. All right. I want to say thank you to everybody who's been watching this playthrough so far. And thank you so much for commenting and liking the videos. And if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure that you do so. It really means a lot to me. Give the video a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below if you think my new area is looking good or not. Or if you have any suggestions to what I should be thinking about when I build these stuff. I will see you again next week. Thank you so much again and take care of yourselves. Bye bye!